If you got some problems, we'll be there to solve them. We're a squad who can do the job. We're a squad who can do the job. The monster is in trouble. We'll be there on the double. We're the squad who can do the job. We're the squad who can do the job. The monster mask squad. Muffin Mystery! <laughs> I'm so excited! We're going to the Monstrovia Town Picnic! <laughs> <laughs> That's funny, Goo! You look like a two! <laughs> now I don't look like a two, I just look like Goo! <laughs> the Scream Screen always surprises Goo! The Scream Screen! Somewhere in Monstrovia, there's a monster in need. And whenever a monster needs our care, the, the Monster Mask Squad will be there! It's Miss Merkley at her monster muffin shop. We ordered monster muffins for our picnic. Hello, Miss Merkley. Are you calling to say our muffin order is ready? No, I'm sorry to say. <laughs> I'm closing my shop and not baking any more monster muffins ever again. <laughs> no more monster muffins? What? Why? Baking monster muffins is what you do best, Miss Merkley. Not anymore. Not after what happened this morning. <laughs> Poor Miss Merkley. What could have happened to make her close her muffin shop? It's a mystery. A mystery we need to solve. Can Monster Math help us do that? Sure, Goo. Monster Math can solve any problem. Because Monster Math is everywhere. Hey, will you join the Monster Math squad on the job? Join the squad! Join the squad! You will? Awesome. First, we need the secret Monster Math word that will help us get the job done. Ha! Ah, ha! Ah, word Monster! monster. Today's secret monster math word is half. Next time you see Word Monster and hear him squawk, shout out the secret monster math word with us to make something math amazing happen. Half. <laughs> Not yet, Goo. Wait until you see Word Monster again. Oh, right. I always forget. Come on, Monster Math Squad, to Miss Merkley's muffin shop. <laughs> Squad, I'm so glad you're here. This muffin is the reason I'm closing my shop. That yummy looking muffin caused all this trouble? What happened? Well, a new customer ordered it this morning, so I made it. The customer came and got it, and then brought it back saying it was wrong. Oh, wrong. That muffin looks perfect. It's my best muffin recipe. Heavenly half, half slime, half grime. Why would anyone send back a heavenly half muffin? <laughs> Did you see word monster? That means we all need to shout the secret monster math word, half. Are you ready? Let's shout it together on three. One, two, three, half. Look, it worked, a monster math monitor. This little monster likes to color half a picture in. The other half, he never does. That's how he's always been. If he colored everything, it wouldn't be just half. It would be the whole of it. And then he wouldn't laugh. So this little monster only colors half a picture in. The other half, he never does. That's how he's always been. <laughs> what a funny little monster to only want to color half a picture. I bet that means half has something to do with the mystery of why the muffin for the picnic was returned. The picnic! If Miss Merkley doesn't start baking our muffins for the picnic, they won't be ready in time. I can tell you the slimy grimy recipe, but you'll have to make them yourself. I'm no good at making muffins anymore, remember? Don't worry, Miss Merkley. We can do it. We've got helpers, right? We need half a beaker of dust. We know all about half. That's math. Come on, squad. 
Let's, Let's do Monster Math! Oh! I'll get half a beaker of dust. Good! That's half a beaker exactly. Dump it in the bowl, please. <laughs> Oops! Looks like we'll need another half beaker of dust. Hmm. Does that look like half a beaker? No? I don't think so either. Oh, yeah! <laughs> Sorry. There! Half a beaker of dust! Next, half a beaker of swamp muck. Gross! Monsters love gross! And last, you need half a beaker of dragon slobber. Yum! I'll do it! <laughs> okay, that's half. That's it! Now mix it up, please. Okay, into oven monster it goes. My best muffin recipe, heavenly half. Exactly like the muffin the customer returned. Who was this mysterious new customer? Her name is Mrs. Half Monster. I think we should go ask her why she didn't like your muffin. Can we take it with us? Oh, yes. I'd really like to know, Lily. Her address is Half House, which is halfway to the park. Let's go, squad! Interesting. A customer named Mrs. Half Monster, who lives in Half House, which is half of a house that's halfway to the park, ordered a muffin called Heavenly Half. That's a lot of halves! Hello, I'm Mrs. Half Monster, and I'm getting ready for the picnic. Hi, we're the Monster Math Squad, and we're going to the picnic too. But first, we wanted to ask you... If you can help me? Yes, you can. I'm in a terrible rush. I ordered a special muffin for the picnic, but it was wrong. Oh, wrong. So I have to run out and buy something else. Um, about that muffin? Please take these baskets to the park and put half of them by the bench and half of them by the swing. Thank you. Goodbye. Oh, how do we figure out how many are half of the baskets? Ah! Ah! Did you see Word Monster? Then let's shout the secret monster math word, half, together again on three. Ready? One, two, three, half! A monster math monitor! This little monster wants his pictures hanging on his wall. He's going to put picture frames on half of them, not all. To figure out which half, he's got a little game. He lays them all out on the floor and makes two rows the same. When each row has the same in it, two halves is what he's got. The top half gets some picture frames, the bottom half does not. That's a math-tastic trick to find out how much half of something is. Make two rows that are the same. Let's do that with the baskets. Come on! Let's, Let's do, do monster math! So, we need to put half of the picnic baskets here by the bench and half of them by the swing, right? Right! Uh, but how? The math monitor showed us that to find half, we should start by making two rows with the same number of baskets in each row. I'll start the top row here. I'll start the bottom row here. <laughs> Toss me a basket, please, Max. <laughs> Let's check if both rows are the same so far. I've got two baskets in my row. And I've got two baskets in my row. Great! Yeah, here, the last two baskets. One for you, Lily, and one for you, Goo. Let's check to see if our rows are still the same. My row has one, two, three picnic baskets. And my row has one, two, three also. They're the same. <laughs> so each row has half of the baskets in it. Monster math amazing. Now, Mrs. Half Monster wants half of them here by the bench and half of them over there by the swings, right? Right. Half here. And half here. Oh. 
Oh, good job with the picnic baskets. Oh, but I'm afraid I couldn't find anything to replace that muffin I bought that was wrong. Um, Mrs. Half Monster, what exactly is wrong with this muffin anyway? I ordered a muffin from Miss Merkley called Heavenly Half, thinking I would get half a muffin. And that is a whole muffin. I like things in halves, as you may have noticed. Hmm. I think I know a way to solve this. To Miss Merkley's, everyone! <laughs> Miss Merkley, could you please cut this muffin down the middle? All right! There! I don't believe it. It's perfect! One half and another half. Two halves. You've made the best muffin ever, Miss Merkley. I have? That means I'm still good at making muffins. I'll keep my shop open. Yay! But there's still a problem. There is! I can't decide which half to take. Well, why not take both, Mrs. Half Monster? Huh. That's not a half bad idea, Miss Merkley. See you all at the picnic. Good work, Monster Math Squad. We solved the mystery about why the muffin was returned. And we did it by knowing what half is. That deserves a great big monster howl on three. One, two, three. Oh! We, we did, did the math. math. We, we did, did the, the monster, monster math. math. <laughs> <laughs>